course not the morning it's definitely the afternoon happy women's day to all my women in south africa and it's actually women's month this whole month of august anyways but yeah i did what every woman does or should do i cleaned up my room i did my laundry I shanyelad, I wash the dishes, everything like that. Even though auntie does come once a week, but Jane, my space needs to be clean throughout. Even though I'm so angry, like my room looks so neat now. It looks so neat. They still haven't fixed my drawer. I don't know how many service requests I've sent. They still haven't fixed my drawer. Now I need to call the manager and say, hello, auntie, what's going on? what's going on now it just looks crazy i don't have a drawer like it's valo to the drawer i sick and now booze but again zagala and i move right yes if i get a head clip me do and when i get on for nail but anyways i thought i should check up on you guys i don't know if this is going to be a vlog or what but in the world and in the muscle poster and thank you to 8,000 subscribers. Woo. This family, this small family is growing. Slowly but surely it's growing. Thank you so much guys for subscribing, for liking, for commenting. I see my OGs in the comments every single time I post. And it does not go unnoticed. I love you guys so much. And to all my fam gang that I've seen um, on campus and stuff, I love you guys. Don't be afraid to come and say hi as I told you I'm on Mingele and Jagash. I'm Zoshin. I just when I'm walking around, but want to say my name and you say I watch your videos, you know, I get happy. But yeah, I thought I should just check up on you guys to say what's going on. What can an is it what can an or what can an what can an and yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next clipping. Bye. Yes, that we will be making less ATP. So remember, during beta oxidation, we have um, FADH2 and um, NADH plus H plus that is generated for every cycle of beta oxidation because there are typically two oxidation steps in beta oxidation. If you have a double bond, monounsaturated, it means for the guys listen yeah i want to film but again so now what now what like i feel like i've been consuming a lot of youtube lately and all the content is legit the same a lot of south african youtubers i mean i've been watching granted we can say like we've found our niche and stuff which are vlogs and people like seeing what your local um influencers are doing on a day-to-day -day basis but like as a student i feel like it gets repetitive like until when until when and i also don't like filming lies so i'm not gonna now pretend that i'm studying just to make content and go sit on my desk or go to the library to pretend no i'll not do that so if i'm not filming like majority of the instances where i don't film it's because i'm not studying so i'm not gonna film you know what i mean like there's no tears coming up or stuff like that but since god will provide and he'll give me a niche that's gonna be my permanent girly because after filming a vlog like and editing it i love that vlog so much and i think you how am i gonna top it that's why there's like two to three week gaps in between but yeah i appreciate you guys for sticking through it regardless even though it's very sporadic my uploading schedule you guys still stick through it and you watch and you like and you comment and you subscribe and i love that so much we continue to like comment and subscribe especially the comments guys don't forget to comment i love reading your comments and stuff and thank you to the girlies that i keep on seeing on campus who keep on approaching me oh you guys are beautiful you guys are so nice you guys have gotten down to a t someone did my outro and i'm just like oh my god you go make me blush girl you go make me blush and people are looking like like don't look don't look don't look uh, i'm just interacting with my subscriber then after that whole interaction i'm always smiling like an idiot on campus that i have to remember a hey, i'm on campus it's not to smile about <laughs> but you guys absolutely make my day but y'all yeah, see you in the next clip and hopefully by then i'll know what i'm filming so right now it's just bits and pieces of my life 
imagine now i have to film like now you're gonna see me all the time chilling in bed like this why that's not entertaining is it and i know some of you are gonna be like just film buddy we just want to see you but i also want to be like proud of what i film and like feel like i'm actually doing something not giving you the scraps because some subscribe i mean some youtubers that i've noticed sorry my window's open you guys know the drill um some youtubers just film any and everything and you can see they're just doing it like a bare minimum thing a bare minimum thing and i never wanted to look like a bare minimum thing because you guys are amazing and you guys don't deserve that but yeah enough of my little rant little waffle session i'll catch you guys in the next clip between the privacy to the perception it really needs prolonged rain days before the privacy becomes dropping but it's interesting is that some story and which is this one on the right has been in South Africa for many years. We only started picking up new people. And that becomes very important in understanding, especially if you're dealing with plant pathogen and you're wanting to think about ways of managing. So, so before I now go to my example, I have to do this. Get this 
Good morning, beautiful people. Long time no see. I know, I know, I know. I'm just gonna give you guys a breakdown. I hope you can hear me. We're going on a little excursion. <laughs> We're on an assignment, a project. But you all must be nice with the city. the noise let me close the window just to be safe let me close the window oh i just woke up so don't mind my wrinkly shirt okay i just said let me wake up wash my face and show these people my hair because i feel i love a wig them but that old ass wig nkatel nkatel and the state my natural hair was in you guys would laugh at me i'm not showing you guys that i'm just showing you the after the before was crazy but i'm just showing you guys my braids that i got let me show y'all let me show y'all mm, 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 mm. Uh, i want to be a wig girly so badly but braids just look so good on me and i did something i've never done in my life which is do black braids like this is color one oh my gosh oh my gosh and these if you guys are gonna ask me they were 750 well 800 altogether so that's just the same price as normal braids here in pretoria because you know they charge an arm and a leg and i'll um put her at in my description bar below but it's the glam hair on instagram also on tiktok it's actually the glam not the glam hair and the glam was a double a so the glam i'll put the name up here the glam she saved my hair i've been doing my hair by her since like first year you know like she's the best but yo guys i decided to come show you guys you guys are probably gonna get content now because I don't look like a crusty ball within really and she worked miracles. You could never say what was going on here. You could, you can never. But yeah, guys, um, I know I've been gone for a while, like months, I think. But you guys are probably going to get a vlog at the end of this week. Just clips put together. What I've managed to film. And no one comments on my old ass wig. If you're not gonna buy me a new one, shut up, yeah? Shut up. But I miss you guys. Oh, I missed YouTube. But anyways, guys. Hey. Hello. Hello. Really? 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 Anyways, I gotta go. Good morning, beautiful people. I hope you guys are good. We're not gonna speak about the timeline. And we're not going to speak about the fact that I didn't upload this vlog last week Sunday. We're not doing that. We're going to film our first week of the fourth quarter, okay? It's the first day of school today. I only have one lecture in the afternoon. So I'm just going to run some quick errands. And I tried doing a little distress bun moment, but the curls are not curling. One thing about goddess braids... Thank you, quiet. But just so you know, the curls don't last and they look crazy, but it's fine. And don't mind the box over there. <laughs> Those are my working boots. They kind of look so crazy. They're yellow. It caught my attention because they're yellow and everything else is gray. But anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day today. I'm going to take you along with me to um, 
the first day of school. Same old, same old. Come along with me, girl. Come along with me. And I hope you're enjoying the vlog so far. And I'll catch you in the next clippy. Can I tell you guys a funny story, yeah? You know how I said I had one lecture in the afternoon? Well, that lecture got cancelled. I only saw when I opened my portal at around like 10 in the morning. 10 or something. I think it was after I filmed that intro clip. I was like, okay, let me just look and see what I need to go over before class starts. And I saw what they said. No physical class today, guys. I said, oh, interesting. But at least I've got to run a few errands. But yeah, now I'm just going to eat my chow mein, watch um coca, and go to bed. I did um, do some catch up, should I say, for that module. But yeah, after eating, I'm actually, no, I'm not going to sleep. I'm going to read over what I need to know for tomorrow's lecture because I only have one lecture again tomorrow. But yeah, I thought I should just update you guys and say what's up. What do you do? But anyways, catch you guys tomorrow. I think it's probably going to be after my lecture or before. It depends on if I'm not running late or not because the one tomorrow is in the morning. But catch you guys tomorrow. I thought you guys want to come along with me. You're going to come along with me tomorrow. Okay, patience, patience. Thank you so much. <laughs> Good morning, beautiful people. Round two, here we go. Officially come along with me um it's a cloudy day today very cloudy spring day today i think i'm just gonna bring a sweater i see that it's looking like it's gonna rain i hope it doesn't because the umbrella that i have is a chunky one and there's nothing more embarrassing than holding a chunk umbrella and it's not raining but anyways um we are praying for a good day today and yeah, let's get it, let's go. I think I'm gonna put on a sweater because I'm so cool up in. I think it's like 10 degrees out. Are we in winter or are we in spring? Like what's going on? But anyways, catch you in the next clippy. Mwah. I'm done announcing my plans to you guys because they clearly don't work out. Like what is this? but yeah i'm in bed right now yes i said i'm going to be on campus but the rain said no so now i'm watching vampire diaries do you have a problem do you have a problem thanks <laughs> i just wanted to show you guys my typical girl dinner you know what's up you know you got rice mash my cheese sauce yo my stove looks dirty guys i'm cooking and pork chops you know the regular regular you know and don't mind the mismatch of the pots they are from home but you guys already know this but i even took more because i was like ain't no ways and why would i buy pots why is that why is that why is that, why is that? but i thought i should just show you guys and i'll show you the plating at the end yeah can i tell you guys a secret i've already started eating i can't even show you my food because now it looks it looks lovagad and ratagad but oh my gosh oh my gosh i was hungry i really was hungry like ridiculously hungry but I hope you guys have enjoyed so far. So far? <laughs> guys, you know what I've realized? English is not a mother tongue. Let's just be honest. Let's just be honest. Like, the amount of George I've been judging. Despicable. But anyways, guys, I was hungry. I've been hungry, like... It's giving hunger, hey? Mm. It's hot. Anyways, catch you guys tomorrow. That's it for today. I'm even too lazy to turn my back camera. So I know the quality is shaking. Don't mind that. Don't mind that.
I'll see you guys tomorrow. Kisses. <laughs> I don't know the words, but they're the same. <laughs> <laughs> and you know from TikTok, they are saying. I think this is what I'm You see, guys, I'm taking you along with me. I don't know. And you like, I did so much. So nice to bask and it's not even. It's not even promising. It said it's supposed to come out. Really. But it's not promising. But you are nice and hot. Nice and hot? Whoa. I hate hot weather. Really. Yeah. I realized I hate I sweating. Into my bed. So. Yeah. Cool. And chill. Cook. Cook. And I think a lot of it seems to link to antibacterial therapy. Um, or developing antibacterials back in the day because of all plagues that existed, right? Do you guys remember? And back in the day, pneumonia killed three out of ten kids. What is pneumonia now for us? It's not really that you can be cured from pneumonia. But pneumonia was a disease that we have now. What do we call that immunity? Resistance. Resistance. Because of antimicrobial resistance. It is an emerging problem. It is a big problem. Our HOD is the steward of antimicrobial, um, of antimicrobial resistance, which is one of the people who sit with the WHO to make decisions about what are we going to do. Right? So at tax, it's a very big focus for our pharmacology department, antimicrobial stewardship. Yes? Can the resistance of one antibiotic affect other Yes. Yes, it can. I'll show you next week. Okay. Um, especially if they're within the same class and the chemical structure is similar and that enzyme that attacks the bacteria is specific to that part of the chemical structure, that whole class of similar, of similar antibacterials, you can forget about it. So then you one class down, and that's your safest class. Then you go to the next most poisonous thing, next most poisonous thing, next most poisonous thing. Do you understand? Right? So, like, I'll show you guys next week. I don't know who but as far as listening to the second lecture, but then you'll know about beta lactamases, right? If you listen to the second lecture, you'll see. But we'll talk about it next week. I just wanted to come on here and show you guys how crazy I look after I come back from campus. This is my co coast. <gasps> I've been in class for five hours straight, like back to back. But anyways, this is my post-campus look. This is my Bonnie's going to nap look. I just want to show you how crazy this is. I put, as soon as I come back, I put my hair away. Because when I take my nap, I don't like to feel the synthetic hair as I'm trying to take a nap. And I do this because this bra thing hurts me. And I look crazy. Like, I actually look so mental and also to close out this video but i couldn't be bothered to look properly sorry guys to look properly to look proper hey this is today every day if i'm being honest but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog i took you guys with me did i not let me fix this why is it showing down here like hello but i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog um yeah birthday planning has commenced i have so much birthday anxiety like at the beginning of the semester i've written off my birthday because like i'm legit writing on my birthday which is on the 9th i'm writing on the 11th and i'm writing on the 18th like what is that i'm even writing on the second on monday like so as soon as i came in i was like okay so i'm not celebrating my birthday it's whatever but now as the time gets closer as the days get closer how i only turned 21 once like 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 hello but anyways i'm feeling nervous but things will both some dialer i'm going to be old and legal in all of the countries all around the world maybe future 21 year old signing 
out but yes that's it for this week's vlog it's a jambalaya mixed masala going on but i hope you guys have enjoyed nonetheless and i'll catch you when i catch you I'll catch you when I catch you. It's probably going to be after my birthday. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I love you guys regardless. And thank you for sticking by me. More life, more blessings. And we out, baby. We out.